are the biggest things that uh, Keenan's taught you to help you get to where you are now? Uh, Keenan, his, his uh, mindset has definitely helped me a lot. Uh, enjoying coming in and being able to talk with him just about the little things whether that's uh, footwork or hand striking or the bigger things with uh, past concepts and uh, understanding uh, where the linebackers could be and how it can affect the uh, overall business. Are there any specific players here they could be here now or they were here before that has helped you kind of grow into who you are now? Yeah, gosh, shout out uh, Mitch Rossi. Mitch Rossi, uh, as you guys know, walked down here as well and then uh, in the scholarship and it's been, he was, had a huge role last year. He's, he's my big brother on the team, and I've uh, always looked up to him. He's, he's been that guy there. If I need him, I could ask him. How much did that inspire you to see Mitch have that kind of success to make you believe I could have success here too? It definitely helped me. I mean, I, freshman year was hard, but seeing that Mitch has had that role on special teams my freshman year here, and then him getting the goals with uh, Kevin Wilson here and uh, being able to help the team out tight end, I, I knew like he can do it, I can do it. How would you describe your relationship with Cade and G right now? Love those guys. Uh, I'd do anything for them. Um, we're, we're all we're a tight knit group, and uh, we, we look after each other. Uh, Kade's awesome. Oh, he's awesome. And we share some some time, uh, interesting things. What have you learned maybe the most from this past weekend? You know, how's your most significant outing so far? What did you take with? Um, that we can do it as a team. Uh, when we put our mind to something, no one can stop us. Um, second half was fantastic. I thought and. No one can stop us, and from my point of view, uh, just building confidence being on the field. Now that you've gotten this playing time, do you have any specific goals for yourself individually in terms of what's next? As of right now, just uh, whatever the team needs me, just trying to help them out as much as possible. You said your dad was a linebacker in 87? Uh, 87 to 91. What's his best Chris Field story to share with you? Uh, I'm not sure I can share that right now. <laughs> <laughs> what's the best Chris Field story you can share? Uh, just that. He was, he was tough and he was mean and he kind of, he was a little isolated, but he looked after his guys and he would run through the wall. Based on what he's talked about with Chris Spielman, who on this year's team is maybe the most similar to what, the way your dad talks about Chris Spielman? Tommy Eichenberg. Yeah. Tommy. Well, how so? He's tough. He, he's tough and he, when he's on the field, he flips the switch as uh, we do in football, but he flips it and he, he just goes. No one stops him.